In Sunday school, Jimmy Carter teaches the good news of the gospel. But this past Sunday, he had some good news of his own. He is now free of cancer. Here's Michelle Miller. The crowd gathers in front of Maranatha Baptist Church at dawn, five hours before the lessons begin. We thank you so much for coming. To see the man teaching Sunday school. All right, I see you wide awake. In Plains, Georgia, President Jimmy Carter has taught at his hometown church for nearly 35 years. Jan Williams has worked with him the whole time. Mr. Jimmy is one of the kindest Southern gentlemen who speaks what he thinks, stands up for what he believes in, never been ashamed to say he was a Christian. Love without getting credit for being a loving person, even loving your enemies. He seems rejuvenated by this crowd of people. Would you say that? Would you oh, agree yes. with me? I don't think once you're a politician, you ever get over being a politician. He loves the crowds. Those crowds have multiplied since the 91-year-old former president announced his cancer diagnosis in August. Julie Marshall came Absolutely. from North Carolina. Yes, to the Carters, this is just another Sunday. But to those of us who are here, this is a day we'll never forget. Even through his cancer treatments, he never missed a Sunday lesson. And it was in this very church yesterday that he broke the news. When I went this week, they didn't find any cancer at all. So, so I have good news. So. He's going to beat it for... He's going to be here for a long time to come, I hope. Giving lessons from the good book to anyone who will listen. Well, I hope you'll all come back someday. Michelle Miller, CBS News, Plains, Georgia.